Hey there guys, Dex here, and welcome back to another episode of Aspen Diaries. Boy, it is actually a very- there is actually quite a beautiful sunset today. This is one of the rare ones that doesn't appear very often, so it's really great to get a chance to see it. So today there's, um, really not much we're going to be doing. I still need to water some more flowers so I can get some more hybrids. Then get more hy- then by getting more hybrids I can actually get a bit more done. Um, and decorate this town a little bit more. I plan on having, like, another decoration episode next episode, too, you know? Like how the last one was about the hammock. Um, but yeah, today I'm thinking we're just gonna take this episode around catching bugs. Which I know sounds boring, but, you know, figures it, figure it might as well be nice. Especially since it's fall and all that. Wow, hey, I'm impressed to see that you're surviving, you feel me? So, you wanted to talk to me? Wanna chat? You're good at catching bugs, right? Even if you're not, just hear me out. My niece keeps asking me to give her a dragonfly, but I just can't seem to catch one. Any kind would do. Can you go out and catch a dragonfly for me? Sure thing. That's actually very convenient. That's my kiddo. You're the best. It's actually very convenient for what I'm planning on doing today. And as you can see, we have empty pockets, so this should go nicely. All I have to do is actually find some bugs around here, and we should be good to go. So thank you, Avery, for coming up with that. Eh, I'm gonna leave that for now. We don't really have time for that. I'm on a bit of a time crunch because I actually have to do something at 6.30, but let's see what's here. Notice, October 31st is Halloween. Have you got your costumes and candy ready? Hurry. Now that's gonna be a very big episode, I'm gonna be honest with y'all. Um, to me, Tommy advertisement. No big deal. I don't think I want a dolly in my house anyway. That'd be a little bit creepy. Um, but yeah, let's just run around town and see what we can find. Maybe we can find something nice to bring back. Got some clovers over here to pick up. One of these days I'm gonna get more four-leaf clovers for my town. Maybe someone else can help um, uh, lend me a hand in getting those at some point. Hopefully that's the case. I'll probably just like ask for them on one of the... Uh, whoop. I meant to press uh, the A button, but it didn't work. Missed. There we go. Got it. This is a bell cricket. Odd, it doesn't look like money. Mm, maybe I can pay off my loan with, I don't know, two million more of those. Who knows? Alright. What about this? Here we go. Another bell cricket. Alright. These, I used to think those sold for a lot more than they actually do. What's up here? Oh, there's a dragonfly, but I'll talk to Gil first. It's totes you! Ready for another great day? Wait, what? I thought you just pinged me. I, I don't get it. I don't know what it is, but I feel like my room is lacking a certain something. I think I need an extra item on the floor. You know, if you could find a nice small piece of furniture for me, that'd really help me out. Maybe a bug could help you, actually, but I just saw a dragonfly over here. Oh, you tricked me, didn't you? You totally tricked me, so I couldn't get that dragonfly. Something tells me Gale doesn't like Avery, because now I can't find it. That sucks. Missed. Oh, there we go. Just barely gotten in time. Long locust, it got the short end of the stick. Those are fairly common too, I think they're worth about 200 bells. Um, now I'm gonna have to find another dragonfly though. So, one of the things we can find right now, I don't know if I've mentioned this already, is the petal tail dragonfly. They still, they actually still appear all the way until the end of October, which means uh, just in the next week. Just until like next week, so yeah, hopefully that will go well. Let's talk to Gail again. It's so nice outside today, it kind of makes me feel like sunbathing. So, how can I help you? You likey? I don't know why it says that. How about this long locust? It's a small piece of furniture. Oh wow, you brought me a long locust! How perfect! I was just thinking of starting a bug observation diary. I'll be sure to raise it with lots of love. It's odd, it feels like bugs are really gonna work with any piece of furniture you give them. Let me repay you for bringing this to me. Oh, a piece of furniture. Thank you very much. Here's my go board. Thank you so much for helping me. I have no idea what that is, but it sounds interesting. I'm still wondering how she managed to ping me, but then it, it just went away. It's a little confusing, to be honest. But anyway, um, oop. Nope. Stop moving, Sarah. Alright. Almost didn't see this. Check out its walking stick. Well, I forgot to say I cut a walking stick too, but you know. Why are all these appearing next to the shore? It just makes it really difficult to catch these. Another cricket. That's a sticky wicket, isn't it? Or wait, I don't think I've caught that yet. Just a, just the bell crickets. 
They all seem to be falling into my net quite nicely, though. Even if I miss them a few times. Seems to be working out rather nicely. Okay, so... Why is this going off? Cat machine. Let's see here. That's just one. I don't know if that's from a while ago or from today. I'm gonna check real quick. Must have been from a while ago. Island import and tiger beetle. Island import is basically I just have to put 10 things into the um, island box and that'll get me a, um, one Meow Coupon. Really, I just don't really focus on those too much. I don't really need any of the furniture from um, Harvey anyway, so... Or at least not right now, but... It is good to save those up when I actually do need them. So, but that's basically why I don't do too many initiatives, because, you know, not too big of a need. Oh, well, there's Avery. I'm still looking for that dragonfly. Yo, kiddo, you're looking good, you feel me? Oh, for the love of- I said it again. So, I never noticed it until Coco mentioned it a while back, but... Apparently, I say you feel me kind of a lot, like, way too much. She always brings that up. She's always the resident that brings up, like, everything everyone says. Like, oh, you say this too much. It's funny, actually. What do you think? Is it annoying? Should I try something else? Nah, keep on keeping on. Don't listen to her, Avery. What? Really? Well, if you say so, I'll just keep on writing this crazy you feel me train for a while. You know, I've been feeling a little down lately, just not really myself, you know what I mean? But I think you just fixed me. Sorry you had to see that one beside of me, you feel me? Tss. That is actually indeed a you feel me moment. I heard something over here. Oh, here it is. These are always so tricky to catch, and I hate it. Whoop. I hate how tricky these are to catch, because they, like... Oh my gosh. Cut. Just get over here. No. No, don't, don't go in the pond. There we go. Okay, that was a close one. I caught a migratory locust. It migrated to a good spot. Sure did. Okay. Um, oh, dragonfly. I can give this to... Um, Avery. Oh, another one up there, too. Might as well get that one. Not really focusing on their sizes, though. Probably should have. That way it could have been like, hmm, the bigger one is best for Avery. Alright, so I guess I'll take this one. Two. 36.6 millimeters. Alright, now, oh no, leave me alone. Alright, let's go this way. In case you didn't see that, I basically kind of did like a, um, kind of a slide backwards. That way you can kind of, um, if you do it right, you can ignore his other dialogue. So it's pretty useful. My oh my, look at how beautiful that is. I think I should keep this as my thumbnail shot or something. Maybe I can go down to the dock and do it instead, but let's find Avery first and give him the dragonfly he wants. So I figure he really wants it by now. Let's get this first, though. Another one of these. Again, they're pretty hard to catch. Migrated to a good spot. Alright. But I heard him over here somewhere. Or I heard someone. Oh! There he is. Hey, Avery. Again. Wow! Hey! So, did you need something? I've got a bug. Alright, please take this red dragonfly. I know it's not much, but there's not much else that appears this season. Cool! Nice red dragonfly, thanks! This is just a token of my thanks. It's a big dot T. It's another shirt. Yeah. Not a big fan, not a big fan. I know I could count on it, you stay awesome, you feel me? <coughs> you too, bud. You too. <clears throat> yes, even though I was sick, like, a week ago, I'm still coughing. I'm still coughing quite a bit, actually. It's a little disappointing. But anyway, let's go back down to the beach for our thumbnail shot. Gotta use these flowers down here, really. Or, wait, what am I doing? I'm not really focused right now. I do have an extra wetsuit in here from what I remember going to, uh, when I remembered going on the island last night. Mm, I don't know if that's a good thumbnail shot. There's gotta be some open area in my town that I'm not aware of that might work out really well. Hmm. I guess maybe just in front of the plaza tree will do for now. I mean, look at this. Hold on. I think this will do pretty nicely. I mean, look at how beautiful that is. That sunset, coupled with uh, the fall colors, very, very beautiful. Okay, now I noticed a lost item over here, and I don't know whose it could be. Feels like we're getting a lot more lost items nowadays. What do you want, Cheddar? 
Hey, Lucky, you- Okay, you're the one who always gives me items, and I don't know why. Like, can you stop, please? Here, why don't I just give you my drinking fountain? Oh my gosh. He's always the one to give me items, just out of nowhere, and it's weird. <laughs> Anyways, here's another one of those, and since I actually do have quite a bit of time, sure, why don't I just pick this up and see whose it might be? This time, it's, um... Kind of like a lunch bag or something, kind of in that kind of shape. Is this yours, item giver? Drop something. I really hope it's not the last person I run into like it was like the past two times. This is a... Um, I'm not interested in stuff like this, whatever it actually is. I assume that this is someone else's lost item. Uh, okay, well, thanks. You could have just, you know, you you could have just said, oh, this isn't mine, instead of, like, you know, going through that whole spiel, but you know what? <laughs> it's it's okay. It's okay. Smoke villagers just love being dramatic sometimes, and it's hilarious. Let's go over here. I saw Gale and Avery over here before, so... Maybe it could be one of theirs. Who knows? What the... Where did everybody go? Now I just can't... Now I just can't find anyone at all. Let's go into Wolfgang's house. Maybe it's his. How do you do? Good for you finding your way to my place. So, what do you- did you want to talk to me? You lose this? Alright, take it here. Maybe this is yours? This isn't mine. I think you should ask somebody else. Okay, well, usually it's the person who's in their house. From the last few times I've been going around here. But I guess not this time. I really, really hope it's not the last person I run into. That would be really annoying. Okay, who else is out here? There's Gale. Maybe it's yours. So nice out to- yeah, I think one of you- I think you already said that, or someone else did. Anyways, take this. Hopefully it is yours. I wonder if it's always set to be, like, the last person you run into and not the first. I don't know, I'm just not one to, like, pick up lost items and give them to too many people around here. Ah, hello! Ready for another great day? Eh, another great day already kind of went by. So, here, take this, and I hope it's yours. Man, really? It is gonna be the last person again, isn't it? Where'd Avery go? Like, I, I, I have no idea where he went. Well, here's Benjamin, so I can talk to him, maybe, and get some answers. Well, howdy! It's the perfect weather for chilling outside, seriously, so what can I do for you? Drop this. This is prob- maybe it's your bag of food, who knows. That would make the most sense. So that means that it is the last person. Why? Ugh. Always takes the longest amount of time. This is literally like three times in a row now, and it's like, oh my gosh. Alright, I hear somebody walking around here. I think it's just Sarah, though, so... Last I checked, I don't think special villagers lose their items. Okay, so here you are. Next time you probably should have planted a white tulip, that way it fit in well, but... Uh, you know what, whatever. Alright, so is this yours? You're the last person available, so it has to be, right? It has to be, right? Wait, then whose is it? That doesn't make sense. Who, who, whose could it be? Is there someone else inside their house that I'm not aware of? Because I really think that Wolfgang was the only one inside his house. So that's very, very, very confusing. Oh, nope, Astrid is in her house. And Rod is in his house, too. Let me guess, it's gonna be Rod's. After all, with my luck, it is always the last villager, and I don't know why. So I highly doubt this is yours because of my luck, but take it. What? You found my bag! Do you even know what I keep in here? Okay, so it actually is yours. Well, I guess it's not valuable. It's something a kangaroo I once knew gave me, so it's one of my personal treasures. Alright. Thank you for finding out who this belonged to, so please take my banana as a thanks. Um, thank you? What an odd gift. I'd better be more careful with this from now on, hun. Yeah, maybe. Very interesting gift, though. Just a banana right out of nowhere. <laughs> Great. Okay, well... Real quick, I think I should run up to TNT Emporium and, um... Get a piece of candy, because I keep forgetting. I think it'd be nice save up just a little bit more. 
because Halloween is coming up, and that's gonna be a pretty long episode, probably one of my longest. If I can stop hitting the sliding door with my net, that would be great. Okay, anyway, um, let's see. Or are my pockets full? Nope, not quite yet. So let's just take this right here. Alright, I will take it. Alright, let's see. What song is this, by the way? I think I should get it. I will take it. I might actually already have that one. I keep buying duplicates of songs for some odd reason. Oh, actually, the, so apparently uh, Citra does copy my, uh, or my 3DS does copy my information about my play coins over. Not right now. Because my pockets are full, but... I would like to try one, so I might as well just eat this banana that, uh, Astrid gave me. And then... What? No, no, I don't want to talk to you, I want to, I want to talk to the fortune cookie. Uh, okay, here we go. I will take one. Okay, okay, okay. Now, let's eat it. And see what our lucky number is. Hopefully it's not unlucky. There is a pro fortune inside, let's see. You only live once unless you have another guy. Is this gonna be Luigi's hat? It's gonna be something Luigi related. I just, I have a, I have a suspicious feeling this is something related to Luigi. Also, sorry about my alarm going off. I only just now realized that, so I hope it wasn't going off too long. Let's see here, number 24. Ah, congratulations. Prize for number 24 is great, a one-up mushroom. Or wait, oh, yeah, that's what that is. Okay, that makes a lot more sense. Please try again. Well, I can't. It's all sold out now, but... Good to get these items. Thank you for visiting. Come again. Alright, well, I think that'll do it for today's episode. We are nearing 6.30, which I have to go soon, so, you know... Gotta keep up with time. So, I'd like to thank you guys for watching. Be sure to comment, like, and subscribe if you would like to. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye.